Ever wondered how to make traditional Mexican mole poblano at home? Today, we are diving into one of the most iconic dishes of Mexican cuisine, mole poblano. This sauce is a symphony of flavors, blending together chili peppers, chocolate, nuts, seeds, and spices. First, we start by preparing the chilies. Take three dried ancho chilies, three dried pasilla chilies, and two dried mulatto chilies. After removing the stems and seeds, tear them into smaller pieces. Toast these pieces in a dry skillet over medium heat until they release their fragrance. Be mindful not to burn them. Once toasted, soak them in hot water for about 20 to 30 minutes until they're softened. While the chilies are soaking, we'll prepare the mole base. Toast a quarter cup each of sesame seeds, almonds, raisins, and pumpkin seeds until they turn golden. Blend these toasted ingredients with a quarter cup of unsweetened cocoa powder and a quarter teaspoon each of ground cinnamon, cloves, coriander, anise seeds, cumin, black pepper, and dried oregano. Add a little broth to help create a smooth paste. Now it's time to cook the mole. Heat two tablespoons of vegetable oil in a large pot. Saute a chopped onion and four minced garlic cloves until they're soft and fragrant. Add the blended spice paste to the pot and cook it for about five minutes to toast the spices and develop the flavors. Add the softened chilies and two cups of broth, letting the mixture simmer for 15 to 20 minutes. After simmering, blend the mixture until it's smooth, adding more broth as needed. Return this blended mixture to the pot, stir in the remaining broth and an ounce of chopped dark chocolate. Let it simmer on low heat for about 30 to 40 minutes until it thickens and the flavors meld together. Add salt and, if desired, sugar to balance the flavors. Finally, serve the mole poblano hot, traditionally spooned over cooked chicken or turkey. You can garnish it with sesame seeds or chopped cilantro. And there you have it, your homemade mole poblano, a rich and flavorful sauce that's perfect for special occasions and celebrations. This dish may take some effort, but the satisfying complex flavors are worth every minute spent. Adjust the ingredients and spices to your taste preferences, and remember, it can be stored in the refrigerator for several days or frozen for longer storage. So, why not take the plunge and give this traditional Mexican mole poblano a try? You might just discover a new favorite dish. Enjoy the rich complex flavors of this iconic Mexican sauce. Happy cooking!